Hi everyone, how are you doing today? It's Janine from the Little Nuns Room Kitchen. Kitchen today, no I'm not going to be doing any cooking, but I am sat here having a little cup of coffee whilst I do a bit of reminiscing. So something really lovely has happened. Um, our old university was supposed to do a really big uni reunion this year. I knew about it last year by a friend of mine called Richard, Richard Butler. And I thought, wow, it'd be so good if we could do something, like do some sort of stupid performance or, I don't know, something we could pull together because, like, our year was amazing for drama at, at St Mary's, at St Mary's University. And we had the most incredible teachers and the most incredible mentors. And we were given so much free reign. We worked with professionals like our costume lady, Tina B. Cat, she did all the Dudge... De uh, Dudge Judge Dread films. You can tell I haven't had much coffee yet. Um, all the costumes. So, and Hi Bo Yu, who was our like tech tech manager. You know, we were surrounded by incredible, incredible professionals there. It's, it was based in Twickenham, so it's near Twickenham Studios, so it's all connected. Anyway, on on this Facebook page, people are posting pictures from past productions. People are posting pictures of being drunk in the in the um, student union. It's really nice. It's really really nice. And um, and sometimes you watch films on telly and you know reunions can be a complete disaster or you you know you kind of suddenly see your long lost love again or or you know someone that you liked liked at uni and you know never got together with and now they're single again you know there's all those kind of stories, um, but for me what it's bringing up is the fact of this like amazing training that we had and how many productions we did alongside all of the studying. I mean I don't remember ever not having a bit of um, you know just. I barely remember hanging out. I <laughs> obviously we partied, did have fun, but I mean, I'm talking like during the day, like you get lots of breaks at university. But we were, if we, if we weren't studying, if I wasn't studying, then we were uh, we were rehearsing for something, which is just awesome. Um, anyway, today we've been talking about ghetto. So we put on in the first year of university a play called Ghetto by Joshua Sobel, and Gerard was our director. He was the head of department. Incredible, incredible man. And it's the longest play I've ever been in. It was like epic. If you have heard of it, um, it's about the um, the Jewish, um, the uh, concentration camps. And it's about a, an orchestra that survived during the concentration camp, um, one of the concentration camps, because of their musical skills and their singing skills. <clears throat> so it's all based around that. Oh, I say survived, but survived for longer. Not going to... not. So spoiler, not going to give away the story, but it is amazing. It's about the journey of these people. So I actually got to play a real person. It was based on a real person. My, my character was Uma Orishkabea, and I never forget it because it's such an amazing name. And um, so anyway, so we're posting these things and um, a friend found some photos and there's silly, silly ones of us doing things backstage, pointing at random things and, you know, in our costumes. Um, and then obviously, you know, pictures of, of us on stage doing, doing very, very like um, serious things. It was actually the same same year like to talk about um zeitgeist it was the same year that schindler's list came out so as student, drama students we all went to watch that we went to watch it together i remember we were just all de like devastated it was hardcore absolutely hardcore to go through and do that piece of work um one of the guys will wills mcguigan he turned around and said does anyone have the music for it now my dad has a video of it somewhere um back in eastbourne somewhere which I need to look out at some point. But um, he, does anyone have the music? It was recorded. Well, I don't, but I do remember one of the songs. So I thought I would just try and well, not, I'm going to have to whistle some of it because I can't remember the words. And even though I'm a, I sing, um, I, I'm always famed for not getting the right words, words right if I'm just recalling from memory, unless I'm actually performing on stage and then I always get it right. So, so it goes like this. And it's called, I think it's called Springtime. It's the only one that's, that's in my head and has always been in my head and it pops in my head from time to time. And this is a long time ago I learned this, so we learned this. So, um...
springtime? What good is springtime? What good is sunshine when he's away? Springtime, I call upon your sorrow, but I know that tomorrow will be the same as today. That's all I remember. I do remember some words from the, the singy song bit and the bit which was like the it was like mmm mmm and it was fantastic because there was a massive it was literally half I believe half of the first year students and there were a lot of us so huge great ensemble cast powerful powerful stuff it's even giving me the shiver thinking about it right now so I hope that that recalls some memories of people I was going to go live on Facebook on the page and I thought not everyone is a drama student. <laughs> if it had just been the drama group, like our year, I would have done it. So anyway, may maybe I will at some point. But um, but yes, reunions, university, amazing, amazing times to be remembering at this time. And um, just wonderful, glorious gift of learning. Um, just co couldn't, couldn't have been better. I'm not doing rose tinted glasses. It really, really, really couldn't have been better. It was such a gift. That's one of my things where I got in and I just, I just was like elated, so elated and so excited to go. So send him a love. If you like what you see, please subscribe, please follow. As you can tell, this is one of the reasons why I have to do this kind of stuff because I miss those days. I miss days of not performing. I just like, it's in my blood so send in love like subscribe see you again bye